Our camera lens trained on one man. Three goals in three games, and you can't argue with that. We're live on EA TV. Always a terrific venue to watch a football match. I'm talking about the Emirates Stadium here in North London. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical analysis is Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It's Arsenal versus Wolverhampton Wanderers. Well, offside, and we could have made that decision from up here. And this is the Arsenal starting 11. Gianluigi Donnarumma stands between the posts. Kevin De Bruyne plays alongside Martin Odegaard in central midfield. And the main threat in attack today should be Kylian Mbappe. He's taken on his opponent here. A glorious chance. Oh, a moment of pure class. Had to catch it perfectly. And didn't he just? So the game restarted by Arsenal. A wake-up call for the Arsenal players, perhaps. Can they construct a response? Well, just hearing someone has scored in the West Ham game. Alex Scott can provide us with the details. Mbappe! And the keeper more than equal to the task. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Half-hearted clearance. He'll try his luck here. Well, the keeper did his job. Didn't really have to work hard, in all honesty. And unfortunately, we did have to cut Alex off there. Just to confirm, West Ham did score in that match. And they now hold a 1-0 lead. Excellent block. Well, he's certainly not alone. But nothing comes of it. Pablo Sarabia. And danger averted. Well read. Juan Bisaka. Right, let's quickly join Alex Scott because, Alex, I understand there's been a goal at Stamford Bridge. It's a goal for Brighton. They're back level. It's 1-0 with 21 minutes played. Keeper did his job to begin with. And offside, unfortunately. Well, unfortunately, we had to interrupt Alex just then to confirm Brighton did score in that game. And it's now even Steven, 1-1. One, one. Mbappe. And passing it through. Nice-looking move. A magnificent stop. Well, it should be a goal, but take nothing away from the keeper. That's a brilliant save. Who can he pick out? And knocked out of there. Well, behind for another corner. I'll tell you what, that is really top-class defending. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Using his physical strength to make sure he doesn't lose the ball. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. 
And finally, up a cul de sac. Oh, big chance! Must be! Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. Well, we usually think of Vinicius Junior as somebody who can win a game on his own, but he's being kept quiet here. Well, he has to find space in more dangerous areas. He's such a good player around the box, but today he struggled to get on the ball, and that's one of the reasons they're losing here. Wang Hee Chan. Elliot Anderson. And Wolves in a position of menace. Oh, genuine chance. Well, I was on the cusp of saying he's at it again. Looked as though he might score again. Well, he's certainly looking sharp today. That could easily have been his second there. Played over. Arsenal could threaten from this position. He's in behind. And it's gone in beyond the goalkeeper. Arsenal level. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And all you can do is admire the finish by Mbappe. He hits the ball so cleanly. It's a fantastic strike. So back underway, following the equaliser. Kefren Turam. Oh, good vision. Oh, good defending to stop a decent-looking attack. Unable to get himself back onside here. Well, he was always going to be offside. That was the wrong option. Good physical play. The defenders know you can't really allow space like that. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Plenty of support here. A well, disappointing end to the move. Right, I think we'd better go to Alex Scott for an update because I believe Alex has been a goal at the London Stadium. It's another goal for West Ham United. They're pulled ahead by two with Seven minutes played. Thanks as always, Alex. Can he finish? Not a powerful effort, but not threatening the goalkeeper, and he'll be disappointed. Gabriel. And the ball with Alfonso Davies. Arsenal have given it away. Maybe a good position from which to counter. And ball back with Arsenal now. And we very much hope you'll join us for more live Premier League action on EA TV. It's Arsenal versus Luton Town. That should be a tasty encounter. Plenty of quality in those two sides. Certainly one to enjoy. A terrific defending to stop them progressing. Huang He Chan. What can I do to stop him running at them?
Vinicius Junior. Well, a classic example of how to intercept. Declan Rice. De Bruyne. Rice with it. Alexander Arnold. Electing to cross into the centre. Not away completely. Well, threat averted. And we very much hope you'll join us for more live Premier League action on EA TV. It's Wolves facing Burnley. And Arsenal now find themselves in potentially a dangerous position. Must take the lead here. And they have. You've got to say, it has been coming. Well, as you can see again, De Bruyne plays a perfectly weighted pass beyond the defenders. And from that sort of range, you'd be shocked if Mbappe missed out. He just keeps showing us what a top finisher he is. Well, that reaction says it all. That's such an important goal in this game. And the ball is moving again. Anyone's guess how this is going to finish? 2-1 currently. Turam. And into the last 15 minutes of action. Really nice ball. The supporters want to see him have a go. They've only gone and grabbed another one. Two goals in quick succession. Now they have the lead. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, as the replay shows, it all started with that perfectly weighted ball over the top of the back line. And De Bruyne's strike is absolutely perfect. Pace, power and accuracy. What a player he is. Well, he looks really pleased, doesn't he? His side have been really good today. So back underway at 3-1. Craig Dawson. This attack looks highly promising. And a chance to whip it in here. Goalkeeper's ball. The cross delivered too close to him. Well, that one has promise. Not really the ideal clearance. And in the end, no damage done. Great attacking play. Oh, danger here. Can he finish? Couldn't quite hang on. And a harmless cross gobbled up. Alfonso Davies. And in the perfect position to read it. Bueno. It's with Saar. Totaling up all the stoppages, we'll have two additional minutes. That's someone to play it to. Declan Rice. And now it is official. The referee brings this match to an end, and it's a victory for the Gunners. Well, as I keep saying, if you make forward runs and you look to pass the ball forward and have players who can dribble past defenders, you're always going to carry a threat. And that's what they're doing at the moment. Their forward play was scintillating. Some questions regarding the match?
Thanks.